What's hiding in your mouth can make you very sick and be the root cause of many different autoimmune diseases. Are you trying to live a healthier life? I'm Dr. Maryam Horiat, a holistic and biological dentist at Aria Dental, where we provide a wide variety of holistic dental services from preventative dentistry to full mouth reconstruction, metal-free zirconia dental implants, cosmetic dentistry, TMJ, sleep apnea, guided growth in children and airways for all ages in South Orange County, California. Today, I'm going to focus on the connection between oral health, dental material toxicity in your mouth, and autoimmune diseases. What is an autoimmune disease? Autoimmune disease happens when your immune system is overactive, causing it to attack and damage your own body cells, tissues, and organs. On the cellular level, autoimmune conditions are believed to be caused by high level of inflammation that activate the immune system. The five main factors that trigger and may cause autoimmune diseases are number one, toxins, number two, microbes, number three, allergens, number four, poor diet, and number five, stress. Who doesn't have stress? Let's reduce other factors. Let's face it, the reality is that your mouth is not an isolated entity outside of your body. It is attached to the rest of your body. Therefore, any infection and toxicity in your mouth that activates your immune system could negatively impact your overall health, leading to unwanted health conditions such as autoimmune disease. So many factors and substances in dentistry could activate your immune system and cause irreversible and debilitating autoimmune disease. For example, number one, fluoride. Fluoride, which is found in your toothpaste, has been proven to trigger death in many different cells, such as thyroid cells, leading to thyroid inflammation and autoimmune diseases like Hashimoto's. Number two, Amalgam or silver fillings with more than 50% non-radioactive toxic mercury could lead to activations of the immune system and many autoimmune diseases such as MS or multiple sclerosis, ALS or amyotrophic sclerosis, and more. Number three, toxic metals like aluminum, nickel, cadmium, lead, and arsenic used in many different types of crowns, partial dentures, and many other appliances could lead to many different allergic reactions and a wide variety of autoimmune diseases such as Hashimoto disease, MS, ALS, eczema, and more. Nickel is widely used in many dental materials as part of metal alloys. Allergies develop after prolonged exposure to nickel in the mouth could cause the immune system to misfire. As a result, the patients get autoimmune conditions like eczema, scleroderma, and more. Number four, titanium dental implants are metal implants that could also trigger the immune system, causing various health issues. Although titanium dental implants are thought to be safe by conventional and dentistry and medicine, many reported data show that the titanium could trigger the immune system and cause allergic reaction and variety of autoimmune diseases in the body. Look into the alternative metal-free zirconia dental implant if you need a dental implant. Number five, infected dead root canal teeth could lead to many different autoimmune diseases depending on the tooth position and its meridian link. In my next video, I will talk about this topic in much more detail. Subscribe below for more healthy oral health information and more information about root canal teeth. Number six, toxic EDC such as BPA 
or bisphenol A in many resin-based white composite filling and clear trays and appliances such as orthodontic retainers and night guards have been proven to affect human immunofunction and promote the occurrence and development of autoimmune diseases. Remember, not all composite white fillings are healthy. See a holistic dentist who gives you the options of a biocompatibility test to find out what materials are least reactive to your immune system. Number seven, improper airways, narrow palate or roof of your mouth, and crowded teeth as a result of improper facial skeletal growth, lip or tongue tie could lead to sleep apnea, snoring, and mouth breathing which may lead to many different autoimmune diseases such as rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, and more. Number eight, excessive unnecessary antibiotic after dental procedures lead to damage in the human microbiome and ultimately leaky gum and leaky gut that activate immune response leading to many different allergic reactions on autoimmune diseases. Be careful of what antibiotic your dentist is giving you. Number nine, the usage of prescriptions of corticosteroids after dental surgeries could mimic a natural hormone in the body called glucocorticoids, which suppresses the immune system and could trigger inflammation and many autoimmune diseases and chronic diseases such as eczema and more. Number 10, fungal infections such as an oral candida. Research shows that an overgrowth of oral candida can disrupt the delicate balance of oral microflora and trigger and exacerbate autoimmune disease, leading to chronic inflammatory skin conditions such as eczema, scleroderma, psoriasis, and more. Number 11, periodontitis or gum disease and gingivitis or gum inflammations are caused by oral bacteria that could activate the immune system and lead to the several different autoimmune diseases, including lupus, Crohn's disease, scleroderma, ulcerative colitis, and more. All right, to reduce the risk of autoimmune disease from your simple dental appointment, and reduce dental toxicity and oral infection, please visit an accredited holistic and biological dentist who consciously pay attention to their dental materials and offers you a biocompatibility test. Don't forget to subscribe to more healthy, natural, and holistic oral tips. Remember, healthier mouth means healthier life, which means happier life. Thank you.